or how you can submit uh, this uh, sequence into the NCBI gene bank so you need a FASTA file format here you, here you can see uh, if you have a sequence uh, obtained from the company here are also FASTA file you can copy it and uh, you can copy I think I can show you you can copy these are different file I can paste it here you can write submission NCBI and uh, copy the and uh, copy your desired sequence which you want to submit I want to submit it here go to the click on the submission and you can select all and delete and replace it with your sequence so press ctrl s ctrl s will save your file you can now close it and go to the browser for NCBI NCBI gene bank submission here it will show submission portal and how you can submit it all instruction are here I have account and I know the way so I will click it here here you need to log in if you do not have a login ID you need to create login ID with your Google Yahoo or any others they you can easily link it with your uh, account click on the login I, I have account linked account with the uh, Google Gmail account so uh, it is directly going to the Gmail clicking uh, login into the Google account otherwise uh, uh, will show all the account from the gmail yahoo hotmail and many others here is uh, my id is login now it will show submission portal my submission many data my profile you can see all these uh, tabs by clicking my profile manage data my submission here is my profile i can check the my submission if you have already submission that can show here if you do not have any submission it cannot be shown here so I I want to submit 16 SRNA to the gene bank so I will click on the gene bank so click on the new submission click on the ribosomal RNA if you have a fun fungal sequence which is the ITS sequence or plant sequence which could be also ITS sequence you can click it here go to downside click on the prokaryotic RNA for bacteria because bacteria is the prokaryotes and I will click on the prokaryotes if you are doing with plant and fungi you can click it here uh, bacterial I have small subunit RNA which is the 16 SRNA click on it here and you can give uh, submission ID to anywhere so, because uh, you can write it here riso I think I can write a riso bacteria for example you can write any anything for example it is a human uh, human urine related samples or any others you can write it here click click on the continue here are the uh, almost uh, nine steps that you need to uh, pass you need to clear all these uh, first is the submission type which I have already inform you guide you here is the submitter name uh, which is the as such your profile it data uh, you need not to worry about that just click on the continue then seek and then it will ask you sequence technology I have sequence technology Sanger your deoxy sequence and I have an ensemble sequence read because forward and reverse uh, sequence are trimmed and uh, they are uh, uh, consensus sequence are being prepared so I can use 
use it as an assembled sequence read so click on the continue then uh, you it will ask you releasing after processing or you can give at a specific date otherwise I am I always follow release following processing uh, have you removed low quality chimeric uh, 16 SR and don't have any such issues I have already removed but you can click on the yes and give the uh, like time or uh, other softwares but I will click on no and these are pure cultured strains which uh, have been grown in the laboratory and uh, use a single species I click on I will click on that and I will select the file desired file this is a very important click on choose file and uh, I have file on the desktop I will show you desktop here is the sequence here is the submission and CBI file so I will select this one and click open uh, before moving that uh, you need to I, I, I am deleting this you need to go to the NCBI and NCBI will not detect this NCBI will detect with sequence one this file name if you have more sequence you need to type more sequence one sequence two sequence three in this way so control press control s you can save this file now again go to the uh, choose file and show to the submission select to the submission and cbi file now it is uploading now it is uploaded press continue here it start uploading processing data is being processed and it is creating summary and all the data I have done if you have an issue then it will inform you did you know you save time and submit multiple and because I have submitted this sequence before it is all asking um, and that you have been submitting uh, same but I am ignoring this because I am teaching you how to submit I will click on the next continue so now it will ask you source modifying so organisms is the here is the single organism organism you need to write uh, because uh, I have identified this strain as a interfactor chances here is the organism name strain is the you can give code to the strain collection you need not to give this you need also not need to give this for example if you have multiple strain uh, then our table will come and you can choose uh, give organism name and strain very easily so click on the continue here uh, it will ask you author name my author name is this otherwise you can write it here it will show your name here again you can write uh, what you uh, what is uh, this bill strain belong to I have already submitted it this is not allowing me to type and showing you that uh, uh, select anyone then publishing status it, if it is published you can click it uh, it is in if it is with journal publications then you can click in press otherwise you can click on the uh, unpublish you need not to worry about this title otherwise it is optional you can give title here or not it's up to you because you can uh, say that it is the maze 
sphere strain i can write otherwise uh, you cannot you you even though uh, it, this title is uh, compulsory but uh, you can give your own way same as thus then click on the continue So here is the final tab, review and submit, here is the all information, uh, here is the uploaded file, here is the all information and uh, here the uh, uploaded uh, all type of sequence data which NCBI will show publicly and uh, after that you can click and submit, it will submit it directly to NCBI, I am not clicking it because I have already submitted this strain so uh, how then I will go back to the submission portal and it will show as unfinished I will delete it because I already have published this strain here
so guys i hope you like the videos and uh, you learn how to submit uh, your strain into the ncbi so click subscribe my channel and click like button uh, i hope we will see in your in the next video till then bye bye